You're pre-approved, so we can go look at homes, right? No, crazy! I'm gonna give you three things today that you wanna ask your lender for before we get out and look at homes. You better get fired up! Everybody knows that you have to go talk with a lender before you go look at homes, right? It's no secret. But I wanna give you three things today that you specifically need to ask for from that lender before you put that first purchase agreement in, right? Okay, so number one, what type of loan am I using, right? Because there's different pluses and minuses, pros and cons to using the different loans. So you wanna know, am I using a VA loan? Am I using an FHA or am I using a conventional? How much am I putting down? What are the different parts of the loan? What kind of credit score do I need to, to get into the particular loan? You wanna know that information because as a realtor, when you come to me and I'm putting that purchase agreement together with you, I need to know that information and sometimes it tells me the homes you can and cannot look at. All right guys, I gotta take a quick break. Check out my Instagram handle right here. Give me a quick follow, I'd love it. All right, enough of the sales. Let's move on to number two, man. How much money do I have to bring to closing? A lot of people think, mm, I'm putting 10% down, I'm putting 20% down. That's what I need to bring to closing. So if I've got a $300,000 home, I'm putting 20% down, I need to have 60 grand, right? Eh, wrong. There's a whole bunch of costs associated with that loan and your lender is responsible for putting all of those together before you go ahead and put a purchase agreement together. So get those numbers from them so you know exactly what to expect when closing day comes. And then lastly is the big thing, man. It's the thing that sticks with you for 360 months. It's your monthly payment. You don't really care if you're paying 300, 500, a million for your house. I mean, you do, but it's the monthly payment that you're gonna be worried about for the next 30 years, right? So make sure you ask how much it's gonna be. You've got principal, I couldn't say it there, principal. You've got interest, you've got taxes, you've got insurance. Are you in a homeowner's association? What are all the fees associated with that property? And when you add it up, what is the total amount that I'm responsible for every single month for the life of that loan? All right, guys, those are the three big things that you want to get from your lender before you come to me, your realtor, to put together a purchase agreement. If you like this video, go down and hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Here's my Instagram handle one more time. And over here is my Facebook page, right? Go check them out. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. And you guys stay fired up.